Hello, and welcome to episode 31 of Rivers Arcade Review. My name is Ed. This channel is dedicated to the coin-operated video games of yesteryear. Today I'll be reviewing a random game, Nibbler. Nibbler was released in 1982 by Rockola. My first time playing Nibbler was on MAME. Nibbler is a combination maze and eating game. In this game, you control a snake named Nibbler with a four-way joystick. You need to maneuver Nibbler through a series of mazes. Each maze has a series of colorful spots that Nibbler must eat in order to clear the level. Every third level, you face a maze with no walls, just posts to maneuver around, so you need to be more careful when making turns. In this game, there are no enemies other than yourself, so basically you are your own enemy. As you move around the maze, you need to keep the head of the snake from touching any part of the snake's body because if you touch any part of the body, you will lose a life. As Nibbler eats the spots, he will grow longer. Your snake automatically moves forward and will also automatically turn when it reaches a corner. Certain versions of the game allow the manager to adjust whether the snake pauses before moving when it turns. Although if there is no option, the snake will have a short pause before moving after hitting a corner. If your snake ends at a T-junction, you will stop until you move the joystick in either direction. You have a limited amount of time to complete each level. Your timer begins at 990 and reduces 10 points about twice per second. Although if you go too long between collecting the spots, the timer will begin to click off a lot faster. Although if you do collect another spot, the timer will return to normal speed. If you run out of time, you will lose a life. You begin each new life and level with the new timer at 990. When you clear each level, you will be awarded points for the time remaining. You earn 10 points for each spot for level 1, and it increases 10 points for each level thereafter. You receive an extra life when you begin the 4th level and every 4th level thereafter. As the levels increase, the speed of the snake will also increase. I found Nibbler very fun as well as challenging and highly recommend playing it if you can find it in an arcade or on an emulator. I enjoyed playing this game more than Berserk, but not as much fun as Pot of Gold, so I'm ranking Nibbler 16th overall. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any games you would like me to review, please leave a comment below or on my homepage. Please remember to hit like, share, and subscribe, and stay tuned for future videos.